Hi friends, Sandra from For Your Chi. This is your weekly tarot and oracle card reading for May 22nd through the 28th of 2023. Thanks for being here with me. Whew, I feel like we made it. We made it through the eclipse. Um, t two major eclipses. If you're here so far, count your blessings. Now, the I'm seeing some repeats here in the Oracle cards of the short videos that I did. If you didn't check out your short video for what you need to know right now for your zodiac sign, check that out under the shorts tab, shorts category. That was fascinating. Okay, for Monday, Tuesday, memories of love. You reminiscent of times past. You could be thinking of your childhood. You could be thinking of... Um, your mom, dad, brother, sister, cousin. You could also be thinking of a past love Monday, Tuesday, this week. Now, we have Andriel. Now, this does not surprise me, especially for those of you that have watched me for some time and that follow my work and get readings from me. You are a light worker. Why, yes, you are. God made you to shine your divine light and love like an angel upon this earth and all of its inhabitants. I've said this last week and on some of the other Zodiac readings of what you need, the short videos, what you need to know right now. Many of you are extremely gifted light workers and talented. Even though you may not do this work for a living, you have no idea how incredibly powerful you are and you are meant to hold the space for the light right now and shine it brightly such that the darkness fears you do you hear me wednesday thursday choose wisely you may feel like you are backed into a corner and that you need to decide, make a decision. However, the message with this card is always do not make a decision if you are feeling um, torn about the choices. You want to come at this place and space of deciding you want to feel at ease about it and there's there's no feeling of ease here and it's a problem if you i always say this whenever this card comes if you need help making a decision give me a shout out email me for your chi at gmail.com what's the advice card fiona okay have you prayed about it now that you've asked the angels for help, be open to receiving divine guidance and assistance. You deserve heaven's help. Why, well, yes, you do. All right, I'm really, I'm digging this tarot card now for the weekend. This is cool. Friday, Saturday, Sunday, recognition and reward. Pat yourself on the back for a job well done. There could be an extra special bonus coming to you. Usually this is a surprise and you don't know what's coming. I get this card when um, people get a, an extra bonus check at work, um, or you could end up winning a few hundred dollars on a scratch off, don't go crazy. The other thing with buying lottery tickets, I mean, the other thing is um, sometimes a relative could just, you know, give you a couple hundred bucks or something like that. Grace and Antoinette, now the Scorpios pulled this card in their short reading. There is someone that you need to forgive here, okay? So, so this message is um, extended to the collective. Someone has screwed you over, and it is time to let that go and forgive that person. You do not have to bring this person back into your life, but rather simply energetically forgive them, okay? to help heal the situation see the other person's point of view with compassion now i feel like this is a misunderstanding for most of you not all of you where the person took what you said or what you did or your actions and they misinterpreted it completely which is understandable 
because we are just coming out of Mercury retrograde. And so now this could be a long term, um, something that happened a long time ago, or this could be short term, something that happened the other day or last week or a few weeks ago. However, forgiveness is necessary right now energetically in order to bring in more abundance. Okay? And that was the message basically that I gave Scorpios. All right, I'm going to start the uh, readings for June. It's hard to believe that it's June already. And I'm excited to see what's coming up for the 12 signs. Stay tuned. Blessings.